Hi, family. Let us read today's daily devotion. Today is Monday, 15 July. You are God's favorite. Hallelujah. The verse is taken from Psalm 149, verse 4. For the Lord take a pleasure in his people. He will beautify the meek with salvation. Hallelujah. The psalmist in the opening verse uncovers a profound truth that transcends mere religious rhetoric. It's a revelation that speaks at the very heart of our relationship with God. Observe that it doesn't say, but the Lord take a pleasure in the beauties of heaven or his holy angels. No. It says, for the Lord take a pleasure in his people. Psalm 1, 4, 9, verse 4. It means God delights in you. Hallelujah. He likes you. Pause for a moment and ponder these words. This isn't a mere about God loving us. Even though the truth is monumental in itself, there is something more personal, more intimate. God delights in you. Someone might think, Pastor Chris, how can he take pleasure in me? I smoked last night. I told a lie last week. Irrespective of what you've done, the Bible tells us that the Lord takes pleasure in his people. And this includes you. Hallelujah. Now that you know how much he loves you and delights in you, live right and do the things that please him. That's why he gave you his nature of righteousness, so that without struggle, you can live a righteous life. Hallelujah. Every so often, contemplate the depth of God's favorite disposition towards you. Think deeply on it. It will change your outlook on life. You will see yourself differently. Every aspect of your life, your work, relationships, aspirations will take on a new meaning. Hallelujah. Now, if God loves you, it must mean he cares about where you are, what you do, where you live and work, who your friends are, everything about you. You can see why he tells you in Matthew 5, 25, NIV. Do not worry about your life, what you eat or drink. Or by your body, what you wear. He doesn't want you agitated about anything because you are his beloved and he knows how to take care of his own. Instead of having anxiety about anything, he says, Cast them on me because I care for you. First Peter 5 7. See how much he takes pleasure in you. His favorite. Hallelujah. Let's take the prayer for today. Dear Father, thank you for your gracious and loving disposition towards me. Hallelujah. Thank you for making me your favorite. I'm divinely favored everywhere I go because you have beautified my life with your grace and embrace me with your loving kindness. I thank you, Lord, for your personal love for me. In Jesus' name, Amen. Further studies. Zephaniah 3, 17, Ephesians 2, 10, and Eternomy 14, 2. God bless you.